All right, a good way to show parallel and perpendicular uh, is by using a diagram like this, okay? Um, first of all, I know that parallel, we use a symbol like this, uh, and it just means basically won't cross or won't touch, okay? Perpendicular, we're going to use a symbol like that, uh, and it just means cross at 90 degrees or makes a square corner, okay? Either one of those is fine. Now, if we look at the diagram, let's pick out a few here, okay? A few examples of parallel would be segment GB, which would be right here, would be parallel to segment FC. So I can write that like this, okay? Uh, other examples of parallel, HE, Segment HE is parallel to segment AD. Okay. Now, for perpendicular, let's get a couple of those. Uh, let's go BG, which is the same thing as GB. We could just write it backwards. Uh, BG is going to be perpendicular to AD. Okay, so I can put that there, AD. And another perpendicular segment would be... Uh, let's say HE again. Let's use HE. That is going to be perpendicular with FC because if I go FC here, HE here, we make this square corner right there. Okay, uh, so it would be FC. So parallel won't cross. Here's the symbol we use. Perpendicular does cross 90 degree angle or that square corner, and this is the symbol we use for that.